How's it going? That was creepy. I apologize. This is like take three. This is terrible. Um, updated my phone to, uh, I'm, I'm on Pac-Man still. I updated it um, to a newer version like I haven't done in like two weeks or so. It was a nightly. And uh, guess what? It sucks. <laughs> it doesn't suck. It's actually a lot smoother, it seems, and there's a lot of extra goodies, and they fixed a lot of problems that were on previous versions, but stuff's messing up bad, like just random stupid stuff. Like I don't have touch tones. Um, the uh, Google Now, like just occasionally just comes on when I click something. Uh, the camera, uh, it doesn't work. I mean, it does, but then it just stops recording randomly. So, yeah, this is my third time. And uh, I actually tried doing a vlog last night, too, when I did my little Twitter G Plus Facebook blackout. Yeah, that was fun. Actually, that was liberating, giving up all social media when you're home. Because obviously, part of my job is to freaking always be on top of stuff, you know, just in case something big hits or whatnot, you know. Um, but of course, I didn't want to have Breaking Bad finale, the Breaking Bad finale ruined, you know, because I've gotten spoilers from previous episodes, so I was like, ignore it, watch Bar Rescue, watch YouTube videos, man, it was like, anticipation was killing, and then of course AMC was playing all the episodes, so then I just, I watched the last week's episode, god, and spoiler alert, I'm going to be talking about this a little bit, and some, what, what happened, so if you haven't seen it yet, turn it off, and come back, and I'll talk, so anyways, Man, there's something, oh, God, the season, the series finale is so good. Just, there was no better way to do it. You know, honestly, I was, I kept going over my head, like, what are they going to do? What's going to happen? Are they going to just throw a curveball? Is this going to, is, I mean, I was thinking, is Gus going to come back? Because, you know, they never really showed him dead. I'm sure, his face got fucked up, but, you know, what if he lived through it? And all of a sudden, he just shows up with, like, a, fucked up face or maybe Jesse's goddamn like Walt's le legitimate love child from Gretchen or something like that because you know they had like a thing what if like she got pregnant or something she gave up the kid and it was Jesse oh <laughs> it would have been stupid it would have been a little far-fetched if all that happened I think it, I mean when I watched that the uh, last week's episode that led into the series finale 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 I was like Man, I just went, oh, this is, it was such a season finale cliffhanger, wasn't it? I mean, where the cops were raiding the bar and, he, and all of a sudden he's gone and they're playing the theme music. It was so like, oh, you guys could just stop right there and then just do a whole other season where Walt is tying up his loose ends. Ah, they could have. They really could have, if you think about it, you know? But I mean, it's okay though, because man, they wrapped it up and they wrapped it up perfectly. I mean... It couldn't have gone really any better, you know. You had Walt um, definitely got, he figured out a way to get um, the money to his family, you know, even though, because he, he knew he couldn't just give it to them. They didn't want it. So he figured out a way, and he kind of fucked over those two little bitches, you know, who kind of fucked him over. So they're scared. That's so awesome how he did that, how he pulled that off. And then, um, um, you know, he goes and talks to his wife or, you know, ex-wife, I guess you could say. And that was such a great, that was such a fantastic, ah, the directing on the show is just, just phenomenal. It's just top notch. Like, I, oof. the directors of the show should be directing every movie that, that's out there. You know, that's, you see her answer the phone and stuff and you don't, and it's like far back and then all of a sudden she answer or she, uh, hangs up and then it like pushes forward and Walt's just standing there and I was like, oh, oh, you guys, because <sighs> he was getting blocked by that little just like, you know, whatchamacallit, pillar or whatnot. And, um, and then it was so awesome too where he just, um, you know, she, he's about to say those words again and I was even thinking, oh man, don't say it again, it's all for the family, all for the family. She even, but then she catches him and goes, no, please do not say that again and he goes, no. I did it because I fucking liked it. And of course, he didn't say it like that. But, yeah, man, that was just like, oh, oh wow. Look at him. He's finally admitting it. Because you knew that he, you know, the initial, the, you know, the initial reasoning behind this whole adventure that he did, um, it was for his family. Because he thought he was a dead man. And he needed his family to be 
taken care of. I mean, it initially was, but then the thing is, that demon inside him that was just cooking inside him that wanted to be let out got let out. And, you know, he, if he was just a mild manner, you know, chemistry teacher, down on his luck, diagnosed with cancer, he had nothing really to lose. And then all of a sudden he just, he grew this other demon and bam. And then he just got that machine gun. Fucking just, that was like some Tony Montana shit right there, man. Um, he just blew all those those Nazis away. It was so awesome. And then, well, the way he even like protected Jesse too. And that was what was cool. It was like, no matter how bad it got between him and Jesse, he always protected him, even though it got pretty bad at times. But he still protected him. He rescued him. And then, of course, Todd got it. Man, everybody hated that guy because, I mean, he did such a good job. <laughs> My God, he was so like nice, and it's like he didn't know what he was doing. Like he's just like, oh, I'm just gonna kill this kid. Boom, oh, I'm gonna kill you. Boom. It, it didn't phase him whatsoever, and that guy had no feelings in the world. He didn't have a soul, and so it was freaking awesome. And Jesse, you know, of course hated him, and he just with the chains, and you heard that. Oh, it's like go oh, Jesse, and then of course Jesse had the opportunity to kill Walt, and he was like. I mean, I kind of wish, like, they had more, like, they talked more right there, but it was still cool, and he just, like, do it yourself, and he just freaking booked it. Then he almost thought he was going to hit him with a truck. Like, oh, is he going to run him over the truck? No, but he just missed, and that's what they, that's what that show is, that's why the show is so brilliant, because you're like, oh, my God, oh, my God, oh, my God, oh, okay. Boom, oh, shit, you know? It's like, that's what's so great, and then, and then for him to just walk into that meth lab and touch in the equipment as that one song's playing, and then he just falls down and he dies with a smile on his face. I mean, it was, I got choked up. I had a lump. I had a lump in my throat. I was just like sitting there like, oh, man, this is over. And I, and I got into it like three weeks ago. So, you know, <laughs> I wasn't there from the beginning. I got hooked three weeks ago and I powered through because I knew I needed to catch, catch up before the finale. And it was, there was no better way it could have went because he tied up all his loose ends he rescued Jesse. Jesse finally is free from Walt, and he died. Just, I mean, Walt always knew he was going to die, so he did, you know, and he needed to leave money f for his kids, which he did. So, I mean, it just, the writing on that show is phenomenal. I mean, it inspires me, that's for sure. I've been actually writing a book, and I've been on and off with it. You know, it's actually been a story I've had for like 10 years, and it's got a lot of twists and turns, and just actually watching that show makes me want to just go back and just really develop characters, and, and more, maybe even more twists, and eh. anyways, I've been talking too much, and uh, look for autocorrect and device updates later, and I'll talk to you guys later, hit that like, thumbs up, let me know what you guys thought too about the finale of Breaking Bad, it was so good, so good, I'm gonna miss it, every time I see commercial for it, and AMC thick, and I'm like, <laughs> why but it's so good i mean the acting superb nobody did bad there was not a bad character in the show so it's just all good all right guys talk to you later